In a world where we're often boxed into expectations, we sometimes encounter those who shatter these molds entirely. They are the ones who dare to challenge the status quo, to question the norms, and to redefine what it means to embody the divine masculine. Often, society places certain expectations on the divine masculine, to be strong, to be a provider, to be unemotional. But breaking these expectations, that's where the magic happens. Imagine a divine masculine that is not afraid to show vulnerability, to express emotions, to nurture and care. It's a radical shift and it's happening right before our eyes. It's a shift that's challenging centuries of conditioning of societal norms and expectations. And it's not just about the divine masculine. It's about all of us breaking free from the expectations that hold us back, that limit our potential. Expectations are merely constructs of the mind and nothing is more liberating than breaking free from them. But what is this divine masculine we speak of? Is it merely an idea, a concept, or something more profound? In our quest to understand the divine masculine, we journey back to ancient spiritual traditions. The idea of the divine masculine is not new. It has roots in various cultures and religions worldwide. It represents an aspect of the universal consciousness, the active, outward-facing energy that drives creation, protection, and action. Now, it's important to note that the divine masculine is not confined by gender. It doesn't imply maleness in the biological sense. It's about energy, not anatomy. The divine masculine is an energy that everyone, regardless of gender, can tap into. This energy is about stepping into your power, embracing responsibility and leading with integrity and courage. But how does this energy manifest in our lives? You see, the divine masculine is the force that propels us to stand our ground, to speak our truth, to forge our path. It's the energy that encourages us to be assertive, to take action, to strive for balance and justice. It's the drive that fuels our ambition, our determination, our resilience. Yet, the divine masculine is not about dominance, but about balance. It's the complement to the divine feminine, the yin to its yang. It's about harmonious integration, the dance of opposites that creates the rhythm of life. The divine masculine in its healthiest form is nurturing, supportive, and respectful. It values strength, but not at the expense of compassion. It appreciates logic, but also honors intuition. It seeks to protect, not control. It desires to understand, not dominate. In our personal and spiritual growth, the divine masculine plays a crucial role. It enables us to take charge of our lives, to set boundaries, to pursue our goals with determination and grit. It empowers us to be the architects of our destiny, to shape our world with our actions and choices. The Divine Masculine, then, is not just a concept but a transformative energy that can lead us to a deeper understanding of ourselves and our place in the world. What happens when we break away from societal norms and expectations? What power does this hold? Let's delve into the transformative power of breaking expectations. Imagine a bird confined to its cage, bound by the bars that limit its flight. Now consider the divine masculine within us as that bird. The cage? It's the societal norms and expectations that we've been conditioned to believe and adhere to. Breaking these expectations isn't just about rebellion or defiance. It's about freeing that bird, allowing it to spread its wings and explore the vast expanse of the sky. It's about acknowledging the divine masculine within us, not as society dictates, but as we truly perceive and understand it. This process is transformative. It's like shedding an old skin and emerging anew. It's an awakening, a realization of the self that goes beyond the physical and dives into the spiritual. It's about breaking the mold and embracing the unique individuality that lies within each of us unfiltered and unaltered by societal expectations. Breaking expectations related to the divine masculine can lead to personal growth. It's a journey of self-discovery, a voyage into the depths of our being where we uncover aspects of ourselves that we might not have been aware of. It's about embracing our strengths, acknowledging our vulnerabilities and learning to balance the two. Moreover, this breaking of expectations allows for a deeper connection with the spiritual realm. It's like unlocking a door that leads to a realm of divine energy, a realm that resonates with the true essence of our being. So when we talk about breaking expectations, we're not just talking about challenging societal norms. 
We're talking about challenging our own perceptions, our own understanding of ourselves. It's a journey of transformation, growth and spiritual awakening. Breaking expectations is not just about defiance. It's about discovering our true potential and embracing the divine energy within us. Our spiritual guides often communicate messages to us, urging us to break free from the confines of expectations. But why? Well, let's delve into this. Our spiritual guides, these invisible mentors, exist in our lives to help us navigate the seas of self-discovery and personal growth. They are the compass guiding us on our journey, the lighthouse in our stormy nights. It may seem like they are leading us into uncharted territories, pushing us to break expectations, but there's a purpose behind it. You see, expectations are like chains. They bind us to a predetermined path, stifling our growth and dimming our divine masculine energy. Our spiritual guides with their infinite wisdom encourage us to break these chains, to free ourselves from the shackles of societal norms and expectations. They're not just pushing us to break expectations for the sake of rebellion, but to guide us towards our true potential. Now, let's talk about the divine masculine energy. This energy is not about gender. It's about balance. It's the energy of action, of decision-making, of stepping forward into the world with courage and determination. It's about embracing our personal power and our ability to make positive changes in our lives and in the world around us. Our spiritual guides see this energy within us. They see our potential, our strength, our ability to change the world. And they want us to see it too. That's why they push us to break expectations, to step out of our comfort zones and into the unknown. Because it's in the unknown that we find our true selves. It's in the unknown that we find our divine masculine energy. So, when you feel that nudge, that whisper in your ear urging you to take a leap of faith, know that it's your spiritual guides encouraging you to break free from expectations. They are guiding you towards your true potential, towards the divine masculine energy within you that is waiting to be unleashed. Our guides are there to help us navigate this journey of self-discovery, leading us towards a greater understanding of our divine masculine energy and the power of breaking expectations. Embracing the unexpected can be a daunting task, so how do we do it? Well, the first step towards embracing the unexpected is cultivating self-awareness. When you're aware of your thoughts, feelings, and actions, you're better equipped to navigate any unexpected twists and turns life throws at you. Self-awareness allows you to understand your reactions, your triggers, and your fears. It's like having a compass in the wilderness of life. Now, once you're self-aware, the next step is to have courage. This is not about being fearless, it's about acknowledging your fears and deciding to move forward despite them. It's about taking a leap of faith into the unknown, trusting that whatever happens, you have the strength to handle it. Courage is not the absence of fear, but the triumph over it. And then, there's open-mindedness. This is where the magic happens. Open-mindedness allows you to see the world from different perspectives. It helps you understand that there's not just one way to do things. There's not just one path to happiness, success, or fulfillment. There are multiple paths, and sometimes the unexpected ones lead to the most beautiful destinations. So, how do we cultivate these qualities? It starts with simple actions. Spend time alone, meditate, journal, reflect. These are all tools to increase self-awareness. To build courage, Start by taking small risks, stepping out of your comfort zone, speaking your truth. And to develop open-mindedness, expose yourself to different ideas, cultures, philosophies. Read, travel, talk to people who think differently than you. Remember, embracing the unexpected is not about controlling the future. It's about being flexible and adaptable. It's about being open to possibilities and trusting in your ability to handle whatever comes your way. And here's the most beautiful thing about this journey. The more you embrace the unexpected, the more life opens up to you. The more you break away from societal expectations, the more you discover your true self and your unique path in this world. Breaking expectations and embracing the unexpected is a journey that requires courage, but the rewards are immeasurable. 
breaking expectations, embracing the divine masculine energy, and heeding our spiritual guide's messages can lead us on a transformative journey. We've explored how breaking the mold allows us to tap into the divine masculine, a powerful force that is often overlooked or misunderstood. This energy, when harnessed, can drive us toward growth, resilience, and authentic self-expression. The act of shattering expectations is not just a rebellion but a liberation. It's an invitation to dance with the unknown, to embrace change, and to trust in the wisdom of our guides. It's about realizing that we are not defined by societal norms or external pressures, but by our authentic selves, our spirit, our energy. This journey is about freedom, the exhilarating freedom of self-discovery, self-acceptance, and self-expression. Remember, life is not about fitting into boxes, but about breaking them and discovering the divine energy that resides within us all.